Thank you. Welcome, uh, Coach Ben Olsen from Houston. We can start. Uh, ben, you come that close uh, to getting a, a tie, a result you would have liked. What? Uh, how do you feel about a game like that? Yeah, it's, it stings a little bit in, in, in the moment, but uh, afterwards, you know, the, the thoughts uh, with the staff and, and the players that it was a heck of an effort from from our group. And uh, we, we lived the fight another day. We get our away goal. Uh, we lose the game, but the away goal is is important. And now we get uh, get to go back home and have them at our, our place. And uh, a lot of really good performances. And we found out some things about ourselves. Uh, and that's that's part of these early games. Uh, score, uh, score a goal. Scored the, another goal, actually, that got called back. Uh, that apparently, from what I'm hearing, should not have gotten called back. Uh, the more people are looking at that. So uh, that's not a lot of fun to, to, to digest that, but that's that's life. It's a very, very tough team. It's a very tough building to come into. It's uh, it's, it's it's smash mouth soccer. It's, it's down your throat constantly. Uh, and I thought overall we held up pretty well. Uh, it, losing a striker in the first, you know, uh, portion of the game, uh, you know, who probably will be out for quite a bit, you know, and, uh, had to make some changes on the fly. So again, overall, uh, some really good performances and, and I'm happy with um, uh, the overall uh, game and the game plan. And, and yeah, it would have been nice to tie though. Go ahead. And coach, even though you're going down a goal, how beneficial is it? Do you think, you know, going into that second leg at home? Yeah, we've been pretty good at home last year and uh, we, we, it's a, they're a great opportunity for us to, uh, you know, kind of uh, stick with that theme this year. But uh, we've turned the page. You know, we have to turn the page very quickly on this this match and 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 conquer calf for a second. And we have a home opener against a very good Kansas City team uh, coming in. So just like that, the season's on us, and it's going to come fast and furious for a while. And uh, we'll we'll deal with uh, St. Louis. Um, uh, you know, Saturday night after uh, we play Kansas City. Coach Daniel Seve Fox to St. Louis. I'm just curious, when we talked in our press conference, you said you almost knew what to expect from a Carnell-led team. Did anything surprise you out there tactically or energy-wise? No. Yeah, it's a good team, good energy. They know what they're doing. He's a, he's a good coach. I got a lot of respect for, for Bradley uh, on a personal level as well and, and also as a coach and what he's done here. I've made it very clear that this is a, a great addition to this league and, and it's, it's a – uh, funds the right word to come here uh, because it's, it hasn't been that successful uh, overall, but uh, if you can step back, it's just a, a great addition to the league. Um, but the way they play is the way they play. It's going to come vertical. It's going to come down your throat and you're going to have to deal with the physicality of it. The set pieces uh, we know are going to be at a really, really high level, both with service and um, some of the big boys that are coming through and Parker's, one of them, and he's a he's a handful. And uh, if you give him enough of those, uh, you, it's hard to keep him off the board. One more question. You you alluded to Ferreira's injury. What more can you say? This is a hamstring. Then, you know, when when a guy goes down that way, it doesn't look good. So uh, <clears throat> that's part of these seasons. Sometimes is you have to weather injuries and. Uh, you know, we got a few guys doing green cards and Hector's out. Quinones just did an ACL, uh, you know, so he's out for the season. And uh, that's why, you know, adding all that up, I think I have real optimism with this team in losing a game. Usually I'm not so uh, optimistic after losing a game, but uh, for what we've been dealt, I think, over the last month, uh, it was it was nice to see some guys that maybe wouldn't have been in this game uh, have good performances. Brooklyn Reigns, a young kid who ends up, you know, unfortunately uh, on the last play being a part of their goal, I had a wonderful game. And it's, you know, it's, it's nice to see some of these guys. Tate Schmidt been out a year for an ACL. He came back and, and I thought had a good performance. So overall, uh, uh, we'll, we'll take the positive from it. You're weathering a lot. Yeah, we all are.
Coach, you're able to get some pretty strong overloads, especially kind of on your offensive right side against City in the second half, especially. Was that part of the blueprint, or was that something that just came from switching the ball and just, and just beating the press? Our overload? Or yeah, your, your overloads. Well, you know, Griffin does such a good job of getting forward into the attack. He's got good speed. He's got good timing. Uh, I thought we could have been uh, uh, more clinical in some of the breaks and some of the opportunities that they afford you here. Uh, again, they're so aggressive and, uh, you know, they can turn you over and get chances if you saw, you know, the, the, they had quite a few of those in the first half, but they also leave themselves exposed. And, uh, you know, there's a, there's a few moments where if we're just a little cleaner, we get looks like we did against Sebastian and, and, uh, also the, the goal itself that can I repeat was not off sides. Do we have one more question? If that's it, thank you very much. Okay, guys, thank you. Everybody. All right, Seba, first goal for you here this year, and an important one just given that it's an away goal. What was it like to score and get the team back into the game like that? on that, just having about four games here in about two weeks, but having those next three at home. The next one is the most important, you know, always it's like this. We don't focus on the, on the league now or something, we just focus on the, on the three match. We, we want to win this game, we want to do everything with this in our legs, uh, just, to, uh, just to achieve the next round, as I said. Uh, of course, it's going to be tough, but uh, we are a good team, we are a strong team, as you know, we believe in each other. So, uh, 